Time across New Orleans isn't happening as often. Still, some say more needs to be done. As Natasha Robin reports, Anna PD Superintendent, the interim superintendent, Michelle Woodfor, says it's all hands on deck effort to combat crime. We have reduced violent crime by 17% compared to last year. While violent crime overall is down, 120 people were murdered so far this year compared to 148 in 2022. Non-fatal shooting incidents are also down 13 percent. Carjackings are happening a lot less this year compared to last. But recent victims, like the owner of Stein's Deli on Magazine Street, says the violence is still a serious concern. Got out the car and uh, they told me to get, get behind the car and keep walking and then one of them cocked me in the eye and, uh, uh, and then they took the car and left. Dan Stein was back at work the next day with a gash across his forehead. Others are concerned about the violence. On the heels of another carjacking at 4th and Law yesterday, makes me worried about this neighborhood. Still, Woodfork points out officers took more than 1,500 guns off the street, stopping some of the violence. We have increased, uh, and as well as increase in gun seizures and gun arrests, are the direct result of absolute accountability and the reduction in violent crime. Car thefts, though, are still way up, 140 percent. The NOPD's investigated more than 3,500 cases this year, compared to 1,500 last year. The driver of this increase is the auto theft of Hondas and Kias, which has become a nationwide issue plaguing the police departments around the country. NOPD response times for property crimes, though, are getting better. Council members and Superintendent Woodfork believe it's due to NOPD civilian workers. We have added a total of approximately 148 new civilian positions. Woodfork says they've hired 84 civilians. This is preliminary data, but what we're seeing is very positive results as we've increased alternative to police response, as we call it. I think um, it's a collaboration of the officers in the field, um, our detective bureau, the APR unit. It's all hands on deck. That's why our crime is being reduced. The superintendent says technology is extremely important in fighting crime. The NOPD now has drones. 11 officers have been trained, and the superintendent says she hopes to have the drones in use in time for the Bayou Classic. In New Orleans, Natasha Robin, Fox 8, Local First.